All right, y'all. Um, I decided to do. Um, I had a top fifty list. I had five videos up. I got one up of the top ten players of all time, but I messed up and I have to get Kevin McHale and um, what's the other guy? Dom no, not Dominique. He he was my man. Oh, Clyde Drexler. Try Drexler. Um, McHale. I missed them two for some reason. So I would take. Uh, I have Richard Miller fifty and Nate Archibald forty nine. But I'm gonna update that list too. But I got my top ten players of all time. I can go to my YouTube and see that. Um, let me tag some people real quick. Yo, Joey, what up, bro? <laughs> I'm just doing my Mount Rushmore at each position. This, this the point guard. I probably should name the lives. My bad. I'm not used to doing Facebook Live, but I figured I'd do it until I get my YouTube followers up. And then you can always upload it to YouTube. But, um, this is Mount Rushmore. I'm not going to do it in order because I don't feel like... I pre I'm pretty sure y'all know the ranking already. But y'all can comment y'all top... What's your top four, Joey? Um, point guards all time. Um, and uh, I got Jerry West as a shooting guard. I know it's a point guard on the basketball reference, but if you look at his numbers, he was a shooting guard. But <laughs> um, actually, I got my four right here. What up, though, Joey? Um, I know you're ready for your Lakers tonight, but um, let's see. I'm ready for the game too. I'm really pissed about the games, bro. Um, it was like three. Um, three duds basically but the only one i could actually stomach was the uh, celtics and raptors um i ain't saying the bus game was bad but Giannis and them oh gary payton um let me see i love gary payton bro i don't care what nobody say bro uh yeah before i get started let me talk about that gary payton is a. Uh, I know i got him pretty high because he, he made nine defensive teams nine nba teams and nine all-star games like that's lethal and he won Defensive Player of the Year. Yeah, and he got a championship with Miami. Starting, he was the starting point guard for Miami. Um, I guess if you talk about point guard, I gotta, I gotta look at my list. My bad, bro. But I got him. Um, I can't remember. I think he in a thirty-five to forty-five. I don't even got him that low. I think he in a thirty-five to forty range. But um, I'm on Rushmore. I'm gonna go by the air. I'm gonna go by. Um, what they call it? Chronological order. Um, I'm gonna go with Oscar Robinson. Um, he's a point guard. I'm gonna just go through the accolades. We already know the stats. He was a triple double machine. Uh, he's a Hall of Famer. He's a 12 time All Star. Um, six time assist. He led the league in assists six times. Uh, he's an NBA champ in 1971. Uh, 11 time All NBA. Um, I got two more people in here. What up, Curtis? Uh, 11 time All NBA. Three time All Star MVP. I'm going over the uh, my Mount Rushmore, for, uh, which is four people for uh, the point guards all time. Uh, 1964 MVP, and then he won Rookie of the Year in 61. Um, Oscar basically, um, this, his stats is ridiculous. I don't care about the pace or none of that. Well, nobody else doing it. Like, and for him to shoot 48.5% uh, as a point guard is awesome. Uh, he had one. Let me see, one, two. If you basically round everything up, one, two, three, four. First four years, he averaged a triple double. Like he averaged thirty point five points, thirty point eight points, then twenty eight point three, thirty one point four. So it wasn't a weak triple double. Like he was averaging almost thirty points a game. But Oscar is eighty one now, man. Like he's a legend. Um, he turned eighty one not too long ago, right before oh, on the twenty fourth. Uh, he got drafted out of uh, Cincinnati. Um, uh, who else watching? I got three people to say. Let me see. Anyway, um, I got Oscar Robertson for sure. And then I'm gonna go to, uh, Magic came in the league next after him. So I go, I'm going chronological order. I got Magic. Uh, this is obvious, man. 12 time off star. He was the lead in assist four times, steals twice. Um, NBA champ five times, 10 time All NBA. That's ridiculous. Uh, he only played what 11 seasons, 12 seasons. Uh, 1980, he made All Rookie, uh, Bird won MVP over him, uh, Rookie of the Year over him. Two time All Star MVP. He won three Finals MVPs, so he's the best player on the best team three times, and the three League MVPs. Um, that dude, I got Magic top five all time. I think I got Oscar like top, um, Oscar top 15 for sure, and um, Magic. Um, let's go to the next person, Isaiah Thomas from the Pistons. Right. And Magic went to Michigan State, too. So Isaiah Thomas, 
um, out of Indiana. So there's two Big Ten guys. Uh, 12-time All-Star. He lived an assist once in 1985. Two-time NBA champ. Five-time All NBA, and then uh, 1982 he made All Rookie Team. Two-time All Star MVP. Um, and All Star games was great back then, man. I love watching those '80s All Star games, and even the '90s too. But the '80s was better. Uh, he won 1990 Finals MVP, the, the second championship. Uh, the Joe Dumars won 1989. Shout out to Joe D. I met him in person at Joe Dumars actually <laughs> at his son's party, Joe Dumars Jr. Uh, because he went to Country Day, and I knew somebody went to Country Day, so that was. Those was for fun times, man. I met Joe Dumars and his son, but um, what else I gotta say? Isaiah Thomas, um, he led the team to two championships. Joe D just played better in the finals. He was twenty seven in nineteen eighty nine, but that's Isaiah Thomas and the fourth person. Um, damn, I hate to say it, but it's Steph, man. Um, because you got Stockton, you got um. Gary Payton, I don't think nobody would put him fourth, but uh, Gary Payton way better defender than Steph Curry, though. But uh, Gary Payton's good. Um, Nate Tiny Archibald, Bob Cousy, um, Steve Nash, Russell Westbrook. I just wanted to mention some of those guys. Uh, who am I missing? Um, then it was, it, was, it was even some good players, too. Like, um, I ain't saying they Mount Rushmore type, but Ross Strickland was a dog. Uh, Tim Hardaway was a dog. Um, Baron Davis was a beast. Uh, I figured I'd name some players, too. Um, that was good. Stephon Marbury was good. I don't know why people hate him. Marbury was a dog, man, to me. I don't care, bro. <laughs> that dude was catching oops like he was LeBron or something. That's how crazy. Um, but Isaiah Thomas is uh, average 19.2 points, 9.3 assists, 45% as a point guard. That's good. As a small point guard. And then... Um... Get yeah, a fourth person on my worth more to me. So, so what's up, Chad? I got Chad and Ray. What's up? I got um my top four point guard. I'm not doing it in order. I just don't feel like ranking them. But um I did it in chronological chronological order. I got Oscar number one. I mean, I got Oscar on the Mount Rushmore. Um, Oscar won an MVP. Magic won three MVPs and three Finals MVPs. And then Isaiah Thomas, he never won MVP, but he won two All Star MVPs and. It just don't tell the whole story. Like, he was playing in the 80s where Bird won three straight. Like, he was playing in the hard era. But and that's similar to now, too. Like, um, I mean, like, Durant only got one MVP because LeBron got, what, four? LeBron got four. Steph got two. And then you got even guys like Harden and Giannis. Yes, it's Stack Lee, honestly, player-wise. But anyway, the fourth guy, Steph. Um, I just think the the lead, two league MVPs, one of them unanimous in 19, uh, 2016, uh, six-time All-NBA, 2010, he made All-Rookie Team, three-time NBA champ, 2015, 16, and, no, 2015, 18, 17, and 18, my bad. That's the two years with Durant. Uh, he won a uh, scoring champ in 2016 and steals champ, six-time All-Star. Uh, Steph Curry would have had probably the best, I hate to say it, but the best season ever, like, for a player, for real, because, um, well, I'm probably going too far, but 2016, he uh, averaged 30 points a game. Um, 30 points a game, 5.4 rebounds, 6.7 assists. He led the lead in steals with 2.1. Led the lead in free throw percentage with 90.8. 45% from three, and then 50 from the line. So he shot 50, 40, 90. So he put a bird and Durant type uh, efficiency numbers, and he a small guard um, as far as like his bulk or whatever. 30 points. Five rebounds, basically almost seven assists, two steals. So he he led the lead in steals and scoring. And uh, the team won 73 games, broke a record. Then they just lost game seven. Like, um, Curry would have had a, bit, a good season. But hey, who y'all might rush more point guards? Man, I got uh, Oscar Robinson, Magic, uh, Zeke, that's Isaiah Thomas, and Steph Curry. Those are my top four. But I can, I'm not going to say where I got them ranked. Closely all time. Magic top five for sure all time. Like, no debate. I got a Mount Rushmore, period. I think I got Magic uh, three or four all time. Um, uh, Oscar Robinson in my top 15. Steph Curry in my top uh, 20. I know I'm high on Steph, but we ain't seen a player like Steph in a long time. But Isaiah Thomas, I think I got him top. Um, I think Isaiah Thomas and Steph in my top top 20. Because you got to think about, um, like, they both. Um, Curry got three championships. And he led a team to one out of the because Durant was clearly the best, but Curry was good. 
Now, Isaiah Thomas won two championships, and he led his team to two championships. And no small guards doing that's just more impressive to me than a center doing it. So yeah, I got. I know people might debate about um, Isaiah Thomas and Steph, but I know Oscar Magic in there. But you can debate I got Steph and Isaiah with uh, um, I don't know. Look, you got Steve Nash was good. Um, yeah, like I said, Bob Cousy, Westbrook. I don't think Westbrook knows Mount Westbrook point guard though, but. Uh, you get people, some people that say he's better than Curry. I don't see how, but <laughs> I'm just saying. Um, let's see. So Curry is uh, 31. Well, he'd be 32 in March, so he's got a long way to go. He just needs to stop getting hurt. But that's it. I think the video's already, let's see. I already did 10 minutes. I'm going to just... Uh, in this video, I'm just trying to build my quantity up too. Like quantity and quality matters. Uh, I just don't want to um, make my videos too long. But uh, I'm gonna do shooting guards next. Shooting guards. That one should be easy. I mean, I want to make a tough one actually. But anyway, um, but that's it. I got that's my 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 rest my point guards. Uh, real quick, Oscar was a 12 time All Star. Uh, I'm just say the best three accomplishments. Oscar Robinson. Um, he led the lead in assists six times. He won the league MVP. Um, and won. Uh, I think he got a lot of accolades, dude. But see, he won an MVP. That's a good accolade. Eleven time All NBA. He led the lead in assists six times. Twelve time All Star. He uh, averaged a triple double. Um, and he averaged a triple double in nineteen sixty two. Thirty point eight points. Twelve point five rebounds. Eleven point four assists. Hi Jasmine. Um, that was Oscar. Then um, I guess uh, Magic. That's obvious. Three finals MVP, three league MVPs, four-time assist champ, five-time NBA champ, 10-time All-NBA, two steals. And I, honestly, like, I know the Jordan fans might not want to hear it, but if Magic was healthy, like, because he, uh, his first, let me see, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Magic played 12 seasons. His first 12 seasons, he made nine finals out of 12 years. Um... And then he had a uh, HIV, obviously. So 92, 93, 94, and 95. So A, 32, 33, 34, and 35. Magic didn't even play. I just think he he would have had an argument with Jordan. Like five rings, like to Jordan six. Um, I don't care. Like Magic, um, I mean, Kareem do got the accolades, but I just, I'm sorry, I would take Magic. I'm sorry. Like Kareem is one of the best centers ever. He probably is the best center ever, but I'm still, I'm taking Magic over everybody besides Jordan, maybe LeBron, but. Then even Magic took four years off and came back and played 32 games. He still shot 47% at age 36, 38 from the three, uh, 86 from the free throw line. He still averaged seven assists and 15 points. But um, even if he would have declined, averaging 18 and like 11 assists, he still would have been. Uh, I think he would have got one more championship probably. Um, but Magic, you got to keep that in mind. Magic career was cut short and so was Bird. Like Bird, the back injuries. And then they didn't have the same technology and surgery as they do now in doctors and stuff. So, and then I got Isaiah Thomas. Um, I guess you could debate with him and um, Stockton. I just think him leading two teams to championship. I mean, he had nobody. Like Dennis Rodman was good, but he's not Carl Malone, dude. Like Stockton had Carl Malone his whole career. Like, come on, like. Um, but anyway, Isaiah Thomas. He's a two-time All Star. He led the league in assists in '85. Two-time Finals MVP in 1990. Uh, well, one Finals MVP. Uh, Joe Dumars won 89. And then he five-time on NBA. Um, he got drafted out of Indiana. But that's it, y'all. Magic, Magic Johnson, Steph Curry, Isaiah Thomas, Oscar Robinson. Those are my four point guards. And I got Jerry West as a shooting guard, obviously. Um, I know people say he's a point guard. But... Um, it was him and Gal Goober back then, but I just got I know West, I think he only 6'2. That's why people say that, but I just think he's a shoot guard because his numbers are like similar to Kobe, but he was a better passer than Kobe, though, and a more efficient scorer. But um, that's it, y'all. My top four, uh, my Rushmore point guards of all time.